Oh no. What's going on guys? Welcome back to Mamba Zoo. And about an hour, two hours ago, the game just updated. Um, unfortunately, I wasn't able to get onto the game right away because there's things going on. But so as you can see, there's a brand new main menu as well as a loading screen before you get in the main menu. I'm not going to restart the game. So if you have the game, just go check it out. It's just the Santa Goat logo. This one right down here and uh, the Unity logo. And we also got change logs. I'll quickly let you guys read that just pause if you want to read it and then the ones at the bottom and also I'll put up on the screen right now changes he has planned for the hotfix that's gonna come probably sometime in the next week I'd say so they don't look like hard fixes to make so we'll probably just put them in anyways we'll get into it new loading screen I think at least new loading sound for when you get in the car this loading screen is not different but the last one was all right I'm pretty sure our stats menu is is different yeah and there's a bit of a black outline around it that I didn't see before but, oh there it is okay we got the new console so you grab that so this allows you to save anywhere so we'll get away from the house Just click tab Ooh, wait there's actually a you actually play a game All right, so that that just saves the game, goes ahead by in a little bit. So, ooh, this is this is weird. I, I have no clue what this is supposed to be. Okay, I don't know what the just randomly shoots, so you got to be like aiming at them. Oh man, level up. Uh, movement speed maybe. This game's weird. There we go. Tact cooldown. Want to shoot more? Oh my god. Okay, we're getting cornered here. <laughs> okay, that's cool. Bullets? Oh, they go in o opposite direction. Oh, that's cool. Alright, um... <laughs> I'm not gonna spend all of the time on the new uh, thing, but this is actually really cool. I didn't expect this to be in it. No wonder this uh, this took so long. Anyways, I forgot I still have that off, but next thing I know for a fact is this thing. You can move a lot faster. Uh, unfortunately, you can't turn a lot faster, but you can move a lot faster. Say if you need to get something under the engine bay, you don't want to go, out. well, you can't go through it side, but then you want to move it back. Boom. And also the mechanical creeper, the location of it saves. Bruh. We got, all, why are all of my radios out of the car? I don't know. Some other things, this game now supports Steam Deck as well as controller support, which is nice. So if you don't have a wheel, but you wanna be able to uh, drive smoother, you can use your, your controllers. All right, so apparently this thing down here now emits light. I don't know if it's just during the night or during the day or you start it. Um, oh, as you can see in the bottom right there, the use and equip, I'm pretty sure that's different. I don't remember it looking like that. So also apparently the seating position in the car now saves. Huh? So if you move... I don't know, but uh, apparently this saves now. And also the transfer case, this thing right here on the truck, that also saves apparently. So the pot, oh, the pause menu is a lot different. Okay. So you can reset the mechanical creeper or, and then the wheelbarrow. There's also a cheat menu. You can activate it. I don't know if you can deactivate it. No support for bugs with cheats. If you save the cheats, it will always be at. If you save the cheats, it'll always be activated. Spawn elevation change. All right, we'll take a look at this. Teleport vehicle, add money, time, water plants, teleport player. Uh, I, th I think this is teleport to you. Spawn object. That probably makes your needs go up. Uh, add a day, disinfect, change gravity, normal speed, fuel cars, and then weather. I don't, I don't want to keep these activated. I just want to showcase them. So I'm going to restart my game. Cheats are gone. So the friendship is one of the first things that you see whenever you look up there and also it shows not talk today no maple syrup can gifted it shows if you talk to them today or not okay so if you are using steering wheel uh make sure you set your presets to these uh at, the, at least these work with the g29 and i assume the g920 
So I tried multiple things to try and fix my wheel not working. I fidgeted with the settings like mm, a lot and I even reinstalled my game. Apparently what does fix it is you go into the main menu, you reset all settings. I'm pretty sure that includes like literally everything, like every setting, but now we're fine. We're no longer redlining. No, we're still redlining. Oh, my bad. No, I'm joking. The new thing, the wheelbarrow. People thought this thing was going to be paid because there was a wheelbarrow at the shop. Uh, apparently, it is free, which is nice. The only way to interact with it is to click here. And you, you're wondering, you can only look up and down, right? But if you move forward and then look left, look right. Uh, I said that in the backwards order. It actually works like that. So you can put stuff in this, like probably birch. I don't know. But there's also something else that I want to try out with that. Okay, so apparently now with the pruning loppers, it shows all the trees that can be lopped. All those ones over there can be, that one can be, that one cannot be, all those ones and obviously the little ones. So this one can be, so we're gonna chop the chop off there. And we're also gonna grab this one, chop that one. And as you can see, all of that disappears once you cut it off. Now the thing that people liked about it was you, you can put stuff in it, but it's like w one log fills it. <laughs> to get in it and move it and no before anybody asked they did not add straps for the truck since that seems to be like the most requested feature imaginable okay and i'm still confirmed it. the alt tab lose force feedback glitch is still here very nice Oddly, my render distance is extremely low, but i'm still not getting the greatest fps all right, so in town, there's some more festive stuff. Very nice. I wonder if we're, we're gonna get winter. Put barrels. Fuck! All right, the Federation isn't open today. Nice. Yeah, that's it over there. That's the 480 liter fast flow nozzle thing for holding maple syrup. So that would be extremely useful for if you had the auto heating unit with electricity. Thankfully, gas prices have not changed, which is good. So we'll take a rip down to the place where the Le Bunker stuff is. I've actually never been over there, so am I going the wrong way? Yes. Yeah, I'm going the wrong way, the racetrack's over here. I completely forgot the layout of this map. Holy Jesus. Okay, I just slammed into him at max speed. Oh, we got trees on top of the, the bridge as well. And a snowman? Holy crap. Okay, so I'm, I haven't given them what they wanted yet, so I don't- I can't show you guys what the machine is, sorry. Oh no. Okay, that wasn't as bad as I thought. Now I'm gonna put this back on here, grab the impact gun that I got during my stream. And I also blew off my tire during a stream because I'm an idiot and forgot that it blew it off. But, but the crisscross pattern, I don't care. So I don't have the, the deep fryer basket either. I'm pretty sure that is <clears throat> level 50 with your mother. Should probably also start growing some potatoes as well, but I have to go get the seeds for that. But uh, I think that's gonna be all for this video, guys. Uh, sorry I couldn't show you everything in the update since I don't have access to the barn and I don't have enough money to get the 480 liter maple syrup reservoir. So hopefully we'll be grinding for those in the near future. Now, I might not, you might not see another video on this game uh until they uh fix some bugs because in the main menu there are lots of issues like my shifter isn't working right force feedback wasn't working right uh but I'm, I'm i'm excited to get back into this game a new update added a few more items and added some more activities plus the that thing that thing will be very useful anyways guys that'll be all and i'll see you guys in the next video